schizoid personality disorder is a mental illness look at this picture shows that person experiencing anxiety depression uh, detail going on introduction schizoid personality disorder is a type of personality disorder characterized by a long standing pattern of detachment from social relationship and a limited range of emotional expression in interpersonal setting it is often misunderstood or under diagnosis due to its subtle presentation and the preference of individuals with spd for isolation a definition schizoid personality disorder is classified under cluster a personality disorders which are characterized by odd or eccentric behaviors the key features of spd is perversive pattern of detachment from social relationship and a restricted range of emotions both of which begin in early adulthood and manifest in various context types spd does not have distinct subtypes however individuals with spd may exhibit varying degrees of the disorders core features some might be more functionally impaired or socially isolated while others may be able to engage in limited relationship or function in solitary jobs causes the exact causes of spd are not well understood but it is believed to result from a combination of genetic biological and environmental factors on genetic factors there is evidence suggesting genetic link as spd trend to run in families particularly in those with other mental health disorders like schizophrenia to biological factors some studies suggest abnormalities in the brain's structure functions particularly in areas that regulate emotions and social interactions three environmental factors early life experiences such as emotional neglect unresponsive parenting and lack of secure attachment during childhood may contribute to development of spd risk factors one family history having a family history of personality disorders especially schizoid 
schizotypal schizophrenia to childhood experiences emotional neglect lack of secure attachment and experiences of isolation during childhood three temperament individuals with a naturally introverted temperament may be more prone to development of spd complications individuals with spd may experience several complications due to their disorders on social isolation profound detachment from others leading to loneliness or lack of support systems to functional impairment difficulty in maintaining job relationship due to social withdrawal and emotional coldness three increased risk of mental disorders high suspectably to other mental health disorders such as depression or anxiety for poor coping mechanisms limited ability to cope with stress particularly leading to substance abuse or other maladaptive behaviors pathophysiology pathophysiology of spd is not wholly understood it is believed to that a combination of genetic predisposition and environmental factors particularly those affecting early brain development and socio emotional learning contribute to the disorder neuro biological studies suggest abnormalities in the lymphatic system and prefrontal cortex areas involved in emotion regulation and social cognition here is step by step breakdowns of the proposed pathophysiological mechanisms on genetic predisposition family history heritability to neurobiological factors brain structure and function neurotransmitter dysregulation three early life experiences attachment issues emotional development four psychological factors defense mechanism cognitive distortions five development of core systems social detachment emotional restriction six reinforcement of the disorder behavioral reinforcement chronicity seven impact on brain and behavior neurological impact behavioral consequences signs and symptoms individuals with spd typically exhibit the following signs and symptoms on emotional coldness limited emotional expression appearing indi- indifferent or aloof to difference for solitude 
strong preference for solitary activities and little interest in social interactions three lack of close relationship no close friends or confidence except possibly first degree relatives for indifference to criticism seeming unaffected by others opinions or feedback five limited interest in sexual experiences little desire for sexual experiences with others six detachment from social norms limited concern for social expectations or norms diagnosis diagnosis of spd is made based on clinical evaluation typically by a psychiatrist or psychologist using the criteria outlined in the dsm-5 diagnostic and statistical manual of mental disorders fifth edition the criteria include a preserve pattern of detachment from social relationship and a restricted range of emotional expression being by early adulthood and present in various context nursing diagnosis one social isolation related to detachment from social relationship as evidenced by the individual's preference for solitary activities and lack of close relationship to impaired social interaction related to emotional detachment and aloofness as evidenced by difficulty forming or maintaining relationship three chronic low self esteem related to indifference to praise or criticism and the lack of meaningful relationship for risk for loneliness related to social withdrawal and limited emotional expression management management of spd typically involves a combination of psychotherapy and supportive care one psychotherapy cognitive behavioral therapy and supportive therapy can help individuals with spd improve their social skills increase emotional awareness and develop coping strategies for managing their symptoms to medication while there are no medications specifically approved for spd antidepressant or anti psychiatric may be prescribed to manage co-occurring conditions such as depression or anxiety three social skill training focus on helping individuals develop better social interactions and communication skills for support groups peer group support can provide a safe environment for individuals with spd to share experiences and develop a sense of community psychosocial medicine for spd focus on improving the individual quality of life by enhancing their social functioning 
and emotional awareness. This may include 1. Psychoeducation Educating the individuals and for their family about SPD. Its symptoms and management strategies. 2. Vocational training Assessing the individuals in finding suitable employment that align with their preference for solitary work. 3. Family Therapy Helping Family Members Understand SPD and learn how to support their loved one without overwhelming them. Prevention There is no known way to prevent SPD but early intervention in childhood for those at risk, children showing signs of social withdrawal or emotional detachment may help mitigate the severity of the disorder. Providing a narratory and emotionally supportive environment during early development may also reduce the risk. In conclusion, schizoid personality disorder is a complex and challenging mental health condition characterized by detachment from social relationships and limited emotional expression. Understanding the disorder, its causes and management strategies essential for providing effective care and improving the quality of life for those affected. While treatment is challenging with patients, empathy and appropriate interventions, individuals with SPD and lead fulfilling lives. Thank you. Have a nice day.